Hello students, today we are going to see about Laplace transform of x of t equal to e power minus 4 t u of t and also we need to draw its ROC. So, we know that the general formula for Laplace transform is Laplace of x of t which is given by x of s that is nothing but minus infinite to infinite x of t e power minus s t dt right. So, here they have given x of t equal to e power minus 4 t e of t. We know that e of t value is 1 for t greater than or equal to 0 and it is 0 for t less than 0. So, this expression x of t I can write that x of t is equal to e power minus 4 t into 1. But this value exists only for what t greater than or equal to 0. So, simply I can say that x of t is e power minus 4 t and that is existing only for 0 to infinity. Okay. So, first we need to find out what is x of t and what is the limit of that. Okay. So, using that I can rewrite this expression as 0 to infinity. Right. So, instead of minus infinite to infinite since this value exists only for 0 to infinite here also I have to rewrite this as 0 to infinite and then e power minus 4 t into e power minus s t dt ok and already we have discussed that right. So, whenever we have e power minus 4 t e power minus s t right here in the limit 0 to infinite I have whenever I have limit as infinite ok try to take minus t outside. So, why because if I take minus t right when I substitute t tends to infinite e power minus infinite becomes 0 ok. Suppose if I keep e power t if t tends to infinity this becomes e power infinity which is infinite right. So, we should not get the value as infinite. So, we should get the value as 0 after the substitution of your limits ok. So, always whenever you have the integral with the limit infinity ok. So, try to express your exponential term such that it is e power minus t outside ok. So, if I take e power minus t outside what happens this term becomes 4 this term becomes plus s ok. So, let us write first s term here it is s here it is plus 4 ok. So, instead of writing 4 plus s I am writing s plus 4 that is all right. And then now integrate this value ok. So, while integrating this value what happens it is e power minus a t form. So, e power minus t into s plus 4 divided by minus of s plus 4 ok. So, apply your integration formula what is e power minus a t dt it is e power minus a t by minus a. So, using that formula I am writing like this and apply your limits 0 to infinity ok. So, let me substitute 0 to infinity limits value here ok. Apply your upper limit. So, the value become e power infinity into any value is infinite. So, it is minus infinite divided by minus of s plus 4. Apply your lower limit already you have one minus. So, minus into minus will become plus e power minus 0 into any value is 0. So, 0 divided by s plus 4 ok. And we already know that e power minus infinity is 0 e power minus 0 is 1 ok. So, using that this value becomes 0 right and this value becomes 1 ok. So, using that I can write that this is 1 by s plus 4 ok. So, Laplace of e power minus 4 t u of t is 1 by s plus 4 ok. So, after determining this value we need to draw its ROC also ok. So, let us draw the ROC. So, for drawing the ROC we have the condition that minus infinite to infinite modulus of x of t e power minus sigma t dt right this value should be lesser than infinite ok. So, when it will be lesser than infinite so this value whatever we are going to apply and integrate this value should be a finite value 
okay. So, if that when it will become a finite value what is the value of sigma that we need to find out okay. So, ROC is nothing but region of convergence okay. That is we need to find the value of sigma right we need to find the value of sigma for which for which this integration becomes a finite value ok that is what we are going to find out. So, we are going to find out a sigma value for which this integral will become a finite value. So, that condition is nothing but a region of convergence ok. So, let me have the given x of t ok. What is given x of t? It is e power minus 4 t u of t ok. Again x of t value is what e power minus 4 t and that exists only for t greater than or equal to 0. So, I can find out this integration such that the limit value will exist only for 0 to infinite ok. And what is x of t e power minus 4 t ok. What is e power sigma t right as it is ok. So, we need to find out this value. Anyway, modulus of this value is the same value. So, 0 to infinite ok. So, uh, take again as usual ok minus t outside. So, what happens this value will become 4 plus sigma ok into dt. So, we need to find out the sigma value such that this integration becomes a finite value as I said before since you have e power minus t right and then 4 plus sigma ok. When I apply 0 to infinity value ok after integration definitely we need to apply this. When I apply infinity this value becomes e power minus infinity right it becomes 0 and we have an extra 4 plus sigma right. So, when this value become finite value if it becomes 0 no issues, but if it should not become a plus infinite ok. So, it should not become plus infinite it should be as it is minus infinite. So, definitely this value right this value it should be a positive value correct. So, if it is positive value, positive value into minus infinite it will be of negative correct. So, e power minus infinite will become 0, but suppose if this value is negative what happens minus into minus will become plus we will get e power infinite it becomes infinite value, but our condition we need to determine the sigma value such that this integration should be a finite value ok. So, always from this integration I can find out that. So, after taking e power minus t anyway if I substitute infinite this value becomes 0, but in order to make it as a finite value definitely this value right 4 plus sigma ok this 4 plus sigma should be a positive value ok. So, I can write that 4 plus sigma is greater than 0 positive value means definitely it should be a greater than 0 value. So, sigma is nothing but greater than minus 4 ok. So, we can easily draw the ROC plot we can easily draw the ROC plot. So, S is nothing but sigma plus j omega take sigma in x axis y axis j omega. So, somewhere we, we should take minus 4 definitely it is negative side. So, take minus 4 ok. So, why we are taking here means again go to the x of s value right this is the x of s what we have determined ok. So, x of s value is 1 by s plus 4. So, here in this problem here in this problem x of s is 1 by s plus 4. So, there is no zeros only poles exist. So, how you determine poles? Poles is nothing but equate the denominator to 0. So, s plus 4 equal to 0. So, s equal to minus 4 ok. So, there is only one pole which exists at minus 4. So, in the ROC plot we have to take at some place by putting a cross mark which is nothing but minus 4 ok. So, wherever I have pole just draw the vertical line ok. So, here sigma is greater than minus 4. Greater than minus 4 means right side of minus 4 it is nothing but greater value right. So, this region is greater than minus 4. So, this region is nothing but region of convergence ok. All the region greater than minus 4 it is nothing but region of convergence. This is what we have, we have to find out 
when they are asked to draw the ROC. Okay. It is very simple. Just find out the Laplace transformation, find the x of s value okay. and then find out this integration. Okay. So, if you want you can substitute and find out like this or in simple I can say that okay. here you have one uh, substitution integration. right? So, before substitution of your integration and substituting the limit we have one integral. right? So, take this integral. Okay, so whatever you have already substituted and you have solved, right? Here, what is S value? You just replace it by sigma. Okay, so that you will get what uh, this value, e power minus t four plus sigma. That's all. Okay, so like that you can directly take the value from the previous substitution method like this. Okay, so once you apply the integration and after applying the limits, right, you will be getting x of s. But before applying the integration, find, uh, before step, you have simplified the exponential term. So, this integration you can take, okay. So, what I am saying, this integration, what is it? 0 to infinity e power minus s plus 4 into dt, okay. In order to find out ROC, just take this integration and replace s by sigma. So, e power minus t sigma plus 4 into dt. Okay. And what is the condition? Definitely this value should be a positive value. So, sigma plus 4 it should be greater than 0. So, sigma is greater than minus 4. Like this from this integration itself you can easily find out the value okay. or you can go for the formula and substitute and find out the value. Okay. So, after finding the sigma value just take x of s find the poles ok. So, here only one pole exists from that pole ok they have given that sigma is greater than minus 4. So, greater than minus 4 all the area it is nothing but region of convergence area ok. Thank you. Thanks for watching.